at Dirt Palace in Providence, Rhode Island. We're on a real busy street in a mainstream gallery. The first time Studio 35 has really been able to do an activity like this. And it's a celebration of May as Mental Health Month for us in Rhode Island and for FHR as a whole. May as Mental Health Month is a national thing that we celebrate. And so we're always looking for ways of how does FHR celebrate it? We're in so many different states and so many different regions. How do we come together with a project like this? And so this was one of those projects where we had all hands on deck. We had two regional directors in the space painting. We had consumers painting. We had hands on staff painting. Um, so it's a really exciting project really to see how the community comes together and celebrates such an important event here at FHR. We were able to take some of the images that have really been known to FHR and to known to Studio 35. The cool thing about this project is you walk into the CEO's office, you're going to see some of these images because we're so connected to this artwork because we're so connected to our artists here at FHR and our consumers here at FHR. And so for them to really be able to come out in the community in this way and say, not only is it May is Mental Health Month, but this is my recovery, this is my journey, and this is part of my journey is this artwork here. Well, I've heard it said that um, the west side of Providence has a higher concentration of artists than anywhere else in the country. And the Dirt Palace is definitely a part of that. So we'll be viewed by many other artists, or, you know, in the area. People with mental illness tend to get marginalized a lot. Like, you know, they can't really accomplish much and this definitely proves otherwise. This is why we do what we do, you know. You can't doubt that there's recovery. You can't doubt that there's hope. You can't doubt that people can really come together and make something beautiful. And that is such an amazing thing as a staff person in the mental health field to really see something like this come together. Thank you.